Hey, this is Drew Baird from Moon Audio, and I'm really excited today to be able to do an open boxing of a new product I've been waiting for for quite some time. It's the new TIAC VRDS701, and there's actually two of these units. There's an all-in-one CD player with USB DAC in it and a headphone amp, and then there's just a transport version. Today, we're gonna open up the one that's got all the bells and whistles, the regular CD player, and uh, let's cut it open and take a look. One thing I love about TIAC is that they do an incredible job with packing. So this packing is very overbuilt. You know, the product isn't as big as this box, but it's double boxed. And you'll be sure to, to know that your, your product is gonna arrive in great shape. And, and in these day, days and times with FedEx, UPS, and so forth, uh, damages are not a rarity. So I'm real excited that they really packed this baby nicely. And we've got our manual remote control batteries, et cetera, here. And I'm gonna have to just swing it out and drop the box. Whoa, not light. I like when a product's got a lot of weight to it. That means that they're using good quality components in it. Oops. <laughs> Those are the sound of the uh, dampening feet that actually float to help balance the unit and reduce resonance. They do that on all of the TIAC products, including the less expensive series, the 300 and the 500 series. Hopefully not my fingers. And the real, Thing I'm excited about this is everything from TIAC is essentially trickle down um, engineering from the Esoteric line. And Esoteric is essentially the parent company and that's where really the R&D and the real magical technologies occur. And all of this stuff gets transferred down to TIAC at a much more affordable price. So here's what this baby looks like. We're gonna adjust the table. Hold on a second. All right, so let's take a look at the front here and what we have here. And, and part of the reason I'm real excited here is the fact that this reminds me, it's very re uh, reminiscent of the Oppo players, right? The last couple of Oppo players that came out were sort of all-in-one DVD players. Well, this is gonna be an all-in-one CD player in terms of it's got USB and digital inputs on the back, so you can use this on your desktop with a computer as well as you can use it as a headphone amp. And we haven't tested the headphone amp obviously yet because it's a brand new product. So I'm really excited to put that through the bells and whistles. So it's really now an all-in-one streaming CD player headphone amp. It's even got a analog uh, volume control stage. So you can use this directly to an amplifier and you don't need a preamp. Um, we've got the volume control for the headphones here, all the switches for fast forwarding, stop, play, et cetera, for your CD transport. It's very possible that some of these features may work for skipping tracks in uh, with whatever con computer configuration that you're connecting to it. I don't know, I haven't tested it yet. I imagine that this is the uh, control for uh, going through the menu system. We've got our power, a power connection here and the transport here, which I need to remove the paper, but, uh, and then an LED light here for telling different functions. Then we go to the back and we'll see that we've got both analog balanced and single ended outputs. That's really great. I like the fact that it's a true balanced analog output stage. Uh, we've got control for RS-232 and remote on and off. So this can essentially, when you turn this on, it will turn on uh, a trigger, an amplifier or a preamp or whatever you're gonna have after this to turn it on. So this can be sort of the hub to start everything in, in the power sequencing. Uh, we've got digital inputs, uh, USB-C, Toslink, coax RCA, then we also have digital outputs. So if you wanna use this with your external DAC that you're really in love with, you can. Or like I said, there's a second version that doesn't have uh, the RCA uh, and, and XLR analog outputs. There's no DAC in it, it's just a transport. It's gonna include these same digital outputs. And in the case of the transport, the USB connection is only for firmware updates and software updates, et cetera. Uh, it's not for inputting USB. So this one will do USB input for uh, a DDA conversion for your computer. And what I really love here is that they have a word clock. Word clock is a very, very rarity thing in a CD player at this uh, price point. Uh, the transport has it as well. Take a look at the CG10 that TIAC makes. It's a word clock, a very cost-effective one. Realize it's not cheap. At, I think it's like 1800 
$1,500. We'll put up the exact pricing on the screen. But the fact that a CD transport at this price point, and we'll put all those prices for the two transports, the transport and the CD player on the screen, it's a rarity. You don't see it very often. So I'm really excited about that. And we've had a lot of great success with that CG10 uh, word clock in, in upping the game, if you will, with all of the TAC products. It's in the, it's in the five series. Um, I think there may be a seven series clock coming. There's a hint of it, but nothing's been confirmed yet. Let's talk about part of the name. The VRDS is essentially what they're calling the mechanism of the CD transport. It's essentially the way it clamps down on the disc and it handles all kinds of dampening and vibration. Again, this is trip, trickle down technology from esoteric. To see that in a product at, uh, at this price point is real exciting. I can't wait to get this into the, the, the demo system and, and put it through its paces. We're gonna plan on doing a full review just of this unit since it basically encompasses the transport as well. We're gonna do a review on the headphone amp and using it as an all-in-one and with a speaker amp and some speakers. So hopefully I've shown you a little bit about what it looks like. Stay tuned, we're gonna do that review later on, video, blog. Make sure to leave any questions below. Make sure to give us thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you again soon.